Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Miranda. If you're new here, welcome. On this channel, we do all things budgeting, cash stuffings, budget with me, savings challenges. So if that is something that you are interested in, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and follow along on this journey with me. Today, we are going to be doing a cash unstuffing slash condensing. And I've done one of these before, but it's been a long time ago and it was not with a lot of money. So this is gonna be kind of like my first time doing this. So we'll just see how this goes. So I do have some money that I need to take to the bank. So we're gonna be taking some money out and putting some placeholders there and kind of swapping out some bills. We're gonna start off in my high priority binder because I have some a lot of money in my home maintenance um, envelope that I want to take to the bank. And I am filming this on Monday, February 19th. However, I'm not really sure when you will see this. May It may not be, it may be this weekend or it may be a couple weeks from now. I'm not sure. So I just wanted to throw that out there. So in home maintenance, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put those hundreds there and I'm going to find a 1000 placeholder i have not gotten to use these really yet i'm gonna use this pretty one i think i got this one in one of my orders as like a freebie i can't remember and i don't remember what etsy store i got this from or got even got any of these from really i guess i could go back and look but anyway if you if you type in um placeholders on etsy cash stuffing placeholders, you should be able to find a lot of these. Okay, so we're gonna put this in place of that 1,000. I'm gonna count it one more time just to be sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 1,000. Okay, and then let's see, we have one, two, three, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 500. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and take out 500. And I should have, I think I saw one of 500, yeah. And we're gonna put a 500 placeholder there. So we still have 1,515. So that will help this envelope a lot. Oh, these, these have never been used before. So let's see if I can get this in here without messing up these placeholders. Okay, and then I'm gonna go ahead and do the car maintenance one as well. Let's see, we've got one, 200. I think we're gonna leave the hundreds, but then we're going to do, let's see, 50, 70, 90, 100, but we're going to trade out these bills for a $100 bill. I don't want to change it out for placeholders yet because I might need this at some point. So we'll see. One, two, three, 20, 30. I can always go back and change it later if I need to. Okay, so let's go back through here. Nothing in food. Pets, I'm not condensing. Travel, let's see, we've got 20, 40, 50. Let's do. 50, 53, okay, and then um, gifts, I think is condensed, but let's check, 20, 40, no, 20, 30, 45, and that's good to go, okay, so high priority is done, okay, so I also, okay, so I started out with, I'm already messed up, guys, so I needed to put what I started out with, so I took out um, 1,500 from home maintenance. I'm gonna stop and check this just to be sure. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 1,300 plus 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60. Okay, and then 10, 20, 30, 40. So at the end, as of right now, I should have 1,500 at the end to put into the bank. Okay, so let's do 
see if there's anything in here we can condense. Usually there's not, but we're gonna go ahead and double check. Um, we can do these two fives, trade them for a 10. For households, there's 30 in household. Lawn care, I'm not going to condense. Health care, I'm not gonna condense. However, I need to put these 200s in the bank because I need to pay for my medicine. So we're going to add 200 and that is for meds. I'm just making a note for myself. Like I said, this is the first time I'm really doing this for real and I just got pen all over my hand. Oh well. Okay, so we're gonna put these 200s in the bank. We're going to trade out there. And I do get paid this Friday, so I will just put, I know I said in my last video that I had that $100 left, $100 left over from Christmas in here. So I'm just gonna put that 100 back in here so I can go ahead and pay for that medicine. Self-care, we're gonna go ahead and change it out for a 20. Okay, fun, let's see. Fun is already fully condensed. School, let's see, five, 25, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we're gonna take this five and five ones. I'm gonna take one of these crisp ones to put there and trade it out for a 10. So now we have 31. All right, so that is it for the low priority. So now let's go ahead and do, I don't know that there's really much in here. I do need to go ahead and pull this. I thought I was gonna be able to make it until Friday on payday so I wouldn't have to pull this money out, but I need to get gas. So we're gonna put 20, 30, 45. So we're gonna add 45 for gas. So at the end, now I should have 1,745. But the good news about that is that will probably last me until almost my next payday. So there's that. Um, okay, yearly subs, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. Okay, so I don't have any 50s left. So we're gonna take those two 10s and put a 20. So now that is condensed. All right, so that's it for my bills binder. And so now we just have my savings challenge binder left. So I do, I, or I know I can condense a lot of this. So let's see, 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, Eight, nine, ten. Okay. So I believe this is 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. So we are going to do 100. And then I do have two pretty crisp ones here. So we're going to take those. Trade those back out there. So we have 102 and roll the dice. So that makes our envelope not as fat. And then the 50 envelope challenge, I think we should be able to condense this to 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 20, 40, 45, 46. Can't condense it anymore. I'm trying to decide if I want to put this in the bank because I think I'm trying to open a high yield savings account. So I'm trying to decide if I want to leave. I think I'm going to leave it in here just a little bit longer and then I can pull it out. Yeah, I'm just going to leave it for right now. 
and that is all there. So that's it for my binders. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna count all of it and make sure it adds up to this 1745. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, so 1200. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Okay, so we should have 15 ones and then that should be it. Let's make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, so 1745, that is what I wrote down. So 200 of that will be going to my medication and then 45 is going to gas. And then that 15 was home maintenance. And I think I'm going to put that into a start a high yield savings account because I don't need it until this summer. Hopefully, fingers crossed. That is all for this cash condensing video. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave them down in the comments below. If you have any suggestions for high yield savings accounts, also leave those down in the comments below for me. I'm on the lookout for one that is good that will let me pull out my money whenever I want to. So if you have any suggestions for that, let me know. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I will see you in the next one. Bye.